Hello and welcome to the session. My name is Bansi and I'm going to help you with the following question. The question says integrate the following function x into log x the whole square. So let us see the solution to this one. Let i be equal to integral x into log x the whole square dx. This is equal to integral log x the whole square into x dx. Now we see that according to the Eilert rule, logarithmic function is given preference over algebraic function to be chosen as the first function. So this will be the first function, this will be the second function. Now applying integration by parts, we have first function that is log x the whole square into integral of second function that is x. So we have x dx minus integral of d by dx of first function that is log x the whole square into integral x dx the whole into dx. This is equal to log x the whole square into x square by 2 minus integral d by dx of log x the whole square will be 2 into log x into 1 by x into x square by 2 that is integral of x dx into dx. Now this happens because first of all we see that d by dx of x raised to power n is equal to n into x raised to power n minus 1. So first of all we will have 2 into log x raised to power 2 minus 1 is 1 into differentiation of log x that is 1 by x. Now we see that 2 gets cancelled with 2. One of the x gets cancelled with one of the x in the numerator. We will have x square by 2 log x the whole square minus log x into x dx. This is minus integral of log x into x dx. Again applying by parts, this will be the first function, this will be the second function. We get x squared by 2 log x the whole square minus first function that is log x into integration of second function that is x squared by 2 minus integration of derivative of first function is 1 by x into integration of x dx is x squared by 2 dx. This will be equal to x square by 2 into log x the whole square minus x square by 2 log x minus this x gets cancelled with this x and we will have 1 by 2 integration of x dx will be x square by 2 plus some constant c. This will be equal to x square by 2 log x the whole square minus x square by 2 log x plus 1 by 2 into x square by 2 plus c. This is equal to x square by 2 into log x the whole square minus x square by 2 log x plus 1 by 4 x square plus c. So our answer to this question is x square by 2 log x the whole square minus x square by 2 log x plus x square by 4 plus c. So I hope that you understood the question and enjoyed the session. Have a good day.